What's up guys? Today Shasha has compiled a super awesome list of things that you can get your wife, girlfriend, daughter, or significant other gifts that don't suck. In case you missed the video where I did the guy gifts that don't suck, now that card is going to be right up here. Check it out. Hand this video to your wife. Get her to pick it out. All of these items will be linked below in the description. They'll be linked. So just one click to get there and one click to purchase. Can't get any better than that. All these items will be numbered one through how many ever she comes up with. That don't mean number one is the best item. That just means number one is that item and that's how it's going to be listed in the description. So there you go, guys. Super simple. Take a look at this and get your girls something that don't suck this year because girls are sick of potholders, kitchen towels, house shoes, and robes. So get them something good. Hey guys, it's Shiloh Coon here. Uh, Clay recently did a video of gifts that don't suck for him. And uh, I've had a couple of guys ask that we do a version for the ladies. So I have a couple of furry helpers here that you may see pop in and out. But we're going to go over that list. I've got 10 items. That doesn't necessarily mean that number one is the ultimate most awesomest gift. We just have them numbered so that you can find them easier in the description below. Here we will have uh, links to everything. So all you have to do is show the video to your sweetheart. Let them kind of look through everything. See if anything uh, sort of sparks their interest. And then they can tell you which number they like. So all you have to do is click the link below. Go to Amazon. Put it in your cart and check out. I'm sure she won't mind if you do that a couple of times. But um, let's get started. Okay, so our first numbered item listed as number one is going to be phaser earbuds um they're going to be here and uh these can come in several different colors i think they have around 10 different colors um the blackout is the color that i've got listed here and they start around 35.99 and go up to around 45.99 depending on the color and it does have free shipping and i will tell you why it is a good thing um we're not going to say for cleaning around the house. Don't tell her it's for that. Tell her, because it does have a little mic on it too, tell her it is just for hands-free while she's busy and has lots of things going on because every woman is busy. She's got the honeydews you gave her. She's got her own list. She's got the kids list. She's got work list, go list. She's got lists all over the place. So as she is running around, whatever it is she's doing, whether it's working out, relaxing, or anything, she will have that. It's hands-free. She can listen to her music and enjoy herself. If you will notice in the next few gifts that I have through the list, I've got several items that you could get a couple of them and they will be a nice little gift um, that she can use to take a little time for herself and relax. So keep watching. Okay, number two is the bathtub caddy. Now guys, in simple language, I will explain it to you this way because Clay thought bathtub caddy. Hmm, you use it to move the tub around? Nope, not what it is. It's kind of like the roll cart, but for the bathtub. Uh, if you were to get one of these other nice relaxing items for your sweetheart, she could maybe use the earbuds and relax in a nice bubble bath. You know, very rarely do we ever get quiet peace time in the tub. If you could give her like a coupon for a free bath, she put her earbuds in, put that bath caddy up across the tub, and uh, just sort of chill. We'll have her a glass of wine, maybe a book or something. Man, if you give her 20 minutes, she will be your sweetheart for days, I'm telling you. But uh, it's just under $40. It's like $39.96. It's called a bathtub caddy. It's made out of bamboo, and the way it works is the legs adjust to the width of the bathtub, and it just props up across there, and then you can just put your things on them to keep them nice and dry. So that is number two, the bathtub caddy. Okay, number three is the dancing heart necklace and it is sterling silver um it's a cz it is not a real diamond necklace but it has um an outer area that's sort of fancy and then it has the middle that's a stone and it clay says it wiggles uh so it is very pretty clay bought me a necklace similar to that i get lots and lots of compliments on it it's just under 35 dollars um it's $34.99. It does have free shipping and they will gift wrap it for you. So it can actually be shipped wrapped. Okay, guys, number four is a Canon mini uh, photo printer. And this is pretty cool. I 
I think it's cool. I love photos. I love the family. I love taking pictures. And if you've got a sentimental wife, she'll probably like that too. I think it's kind of sad that we don't print photos anymore. There's nothing for anybody to go back and look at. Um, because, you know, when we trade phones, things like that, nobody's going to sit around and look through the computer. Um, this particular uh, item is a pricey item. It is $154.95, but it does come with the printer. Um, it is Bluetooth. There's not going to be a bunch of cords for you to lose. Um, and it actually comes with 10 packs of the photo slips in with the cam with the printer. And then it also comes with another 50 of the photo papers um, in the bundle. So you never buy ink for it. It's automatically within the paper itself. And I think that is really, really awesome. So just under $155, if you were going to splurge and get a little bit nicer gift or something that's a little different, that would be a really good one. It's the Canon Bluetooth Photo Printer. Number five, Clay about came out of his seat when he saw how much this is. So don't have a fit, okay? These are Godiva chocolates. They are absolutely delicious. It is a wonderful chocolate. Um, they're actually Godiva chocolate stores in certain parts of America. And I'm sure your wife has heard of them. Can't tell me she hasn't. Um, it's called a Balaton box. And it has different types of their chocolates in it. This particular one is $29. It's sort of like the medium size. There's one that's 14, one that's 29, and one that's closer to 50. So I did pick the medium size. They are a little pricey, but they are very delicious and she'll feel very special. So Godiva chocolates, $29. Okay, number six is, um, it is also a little bit pricey, I will admit. Uh, I have wanted a pair for quite a while and I've never ever wanted to spend the money on myself and Clay's tried to get me to for a long time and finally he bought them as a gift for me before we went on vacation recently. Um, usually when you hear the word Ray-Ban or the name Ray-Ban, uh, you usually think of aviators or you think of ta-da, Wayfarers and uh, that's what these are, the Wayfarers. These are the tortoise shell with the brown lenses and they are polarized. They're $193. And you can see them here. When you go to the link, um, there will be lots of different options. Um, and your special someone may prefer tortoise shell or may not like that. They may like black. So um, all of those options are on there. These particular glasses are $193. They can go up to, I think, around $225 or somewhere along in there. And they go just a little below $193 as well. Um, but I do love these. Um, these particular ones, the brown lenses, are um, a type of, I think, plastic lens. They have a glass lens um, also. I think they're the green ones. And I kind of wanted those, but they are heavier. I do love these. I absolutely love them. I wear them all the time. And I'm so glad that Clay bought them for me. I love them. Um, as you can tell, I do love them. They do fit. If she has more of a round face, this may be better. If she has... Um, a more slender face, the aviators may be um, a better choice. I will tell you, women do have preferences, as you know, so that may be something that you may want to discuss before you make a big purchase. Now, um, I do have the link here below, and it says men's in it. The reason it says men's is I have a larger face, and I did get the bigger size. Some of the Wayfarers come in a small, um, a medium, I think a large, and an extra large. They have several different sizes, but I did get the men's, and I did get the larger size uh, because of that. So, um, that is why it says men's. Don't panic. It's okay. Okay, number seven is um, a tote. You think, what the hell is a tote? A tote is um, sort of our backup for our giant mommy purses, um, our mommy bags. I have one here that um, Clay got for me and um, had my initials put on it. It has two big pockets in it, and that's what this particular uh, one is uh, very similar to. You get to pick um, the font, the initials, um, and the way this works, guys, is... Her first name is the first initial, her middle name is the last initial, and her last name is the big middle initial. So that's the way you need to put that in there. You don't want any uh-ohs, okay? So you get to pick the thread color, you get to pick the initials and the style of the initials. With monogramming, which is a really hot thing right now for ladies, most of the time you can't screw it up. Any style you pick is going to be awesome. So. 
uh, tote bag. She can put all her extra junk in there so that she doesn't have to tote it all around in her purse every day. Um, she can put that in her car too. She can put her lunch bag in it. She can put um, the newspaper, all her little extras, and she doesn't have it in her purse, and it's a lot easier to lug around. So, that's about uh, $21.50, free shipping, and that is a helper gift. That's a good one. Okay, guys, like I said before, monogramming is a big thing right now. Number eight is a silver monogrammed necklace. This is solid silver. It is not a plating. It's not going to turn. This is going to be something that she's going to appreciate. And I know back in maybe the 70s and 80s when, yes, I'm that old, when um, those were a big deal, my mom and my grandmother actually still have those necklaces. They have worn them for years. I have seen women in professional environment that have still appreciated those necklaces and still wear those necklaces. So this is a solid silver necklace. It's not going to tarnish and turn. Um, it is $35. It does have shipping. It's like $4.49 shipping. Um, now with this particular gift, you choose the length of the chain and you choose the size of the monogramming. So remember what we said about monogramming before guys. You've got your first name initial first. You've got your middle name initial last and you've got your last name initial in the middle. Okay. So I just don't want you to get confused. So you'll put that in the notations box when you place your order, okay? But don't stress over the, the chain length and the size of the monogram. It's hard to mess it up, but if in doubt, always go smaller because you don't want the small little petite lady. I don't know if y'all know Miss Shauna. Um, y'all may know Shauna Carmack. If you know Miss Shauna, I don't know that she would want the biggest one they make. She is a beautiful, very petite southern woman, and I think the smaller size is a little better on her. I, on the other hand, usually tend to go with bigger size jewelry to sort of offset this extra fluff I've got. So, um, lengths, 16 inches is a little small. So, unless she's a really young woman, you don't want to get this tiny little choker necklace. You want to get it a little bit longer. 18 to 20 inches is probably going to be better never going to hurt. If you just want to show it to her and say, I would love this. I would love to get this for you. Or if you want to show it to somebody she knows, just ask. It never hurts. Okay. So that is your number eight. It is a silver monogram necklace. All right. So our number nine is the KitchenAid coffee grinder. Okay. It comes in four different colors. So you can kind of look through those. Um, this one's around $25 and it does have free shipping. Um, we bought one recently and this is for, you do have to tread lightly guys, you don't want to buy a kitchen appliance for um, Christmas, birthday, Mother's Day unless it's something that they absolutely love. If it coincides with something they just absolutely love, you're golden. Now if you have this sweet woman that cannot speak to you, look at you, or handle anything with children until after the first half cup to full cup of coffee, this is going to be your golden ticket, okay? What she'll do is she will shop for some lovely whole beans and she will grind them in this lovely coffee grinder. And it's, it is just, you cannot find words to describe the difference in ground coffee you buy at the store and when you grind your own beans. The oils, everything is just Oh, she will absolutely love you. So, again, tread lightly, choose carefully. But if you have a coffee lover, they will love you for this one. It is the KitchenAid Coffee Grinder. Okay, here we are, number 10. I hope some of these have helped. Um, before you say, nope, 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 when you hear the price. Um, this is Snap-on level. This is a very, very nice product. They are hard to find. Um, I can't find them with any hairdressers around here. Um, it is the Bio Ionics 10X. It is a rose gold flat iron. It is extremely nice. It has vibrating plates on it that help smooth the cuticles of the hair as it moves down and make your hair like glass. If you want to try it, y'all can share. Talk her into it. It is $230. It does have free shipping, but it is an extremely, extremely nice flat iron. So um, make sure she does use a flat iron before you order one because it is a bit pricey. But um, I think she will love it and I think she will love you for thinking of her for it. So it's number 10, the Bio Ionics 10X flat iron. Okay, guys. So we have. 10 items. I did try my best. I didn't want to just throw anything in there. I wanted to make sure I put a lot of thought into it like you would. Mm -hmm. uh, 
I do know sometimes you guys panic because you wait till the end right there before Christmas and everything's picked over. So I'm trying to help you ahead of time. Um, again, I really did try to look for these items, things that maybe Clay had bought me before, things that I have, or um, things that I have used before um, or have experienced um, the use of. So um, some of these are really good gifts, and at least maybe it'll help you get a couple of extra ones if it's not that special one. Um, really, in all honesty, it, we don't have to have anything. Just the fact that you think of us is the big thing. and. If you actually put thought into it and you actually try and she understands why you bought it um, I know if, if Clay gave me pajamas I love pajamas and I really do like pajamas I like house shoes I like robes but something a little bit different is always nice but the most important thing is is if you tell me the story of why you picked it out when he tells me it could be a used wonder bread sack that he found on the side of the road but if he tells me this big long sappy story about how it made him think of the first time we made sandwiches on a picnic with the boys somewhere i'm gonna love that used thrown away wonder bread sack that was on the side of the road so um have some meaning have some heart in it doesn't matter what you pick out she's gonna love you for it so i hope y'all have a safe and happy and merry christmas and thank you for watching the descriptions will be below or the links will be below in the description um if you like what you see give a thumbs up subscribe right down here below and also check out my channel i'm gonna put a little in, little link right over here and um we'll catch you guys next time